Hello and welcome back to our playthrough of Halo Wars 2. This will be our final battle. I'm Finn Credible from the VCCS. And I'm Cautious Snake from the VCCS. And yeah, this is the last stand. Mm -hmm. The last mission of the campaign. Let's do it. Well, we think. You never know. I honestly can't wait to see the ending cutscene. I wonder how epic it's going to be. Yeah. <laughs> Professor, what's the update at the control room? I'm in, and I think I found the Halo's weapon systems. Once I've deactivated them, then I'll place the comms beacon. Keep us updated. Jerome, Atriox will be sending everything to stop us. You need to hold the line and protect the Professor in the control room until she's finished her work. Won't let you down, sir. The clock's ticking, and we don't have time to drop a base and build it up. You're going to have to rely on turret defenses, so keep them up and running. Fresh troops will be sent in directly from the Spirit of Fire as soon as they're ready to deploy. And I've got all the ship's weapon systems primed and ready, so we'll help as much as we can from up here. Okay, everyone. Let's get to work. Good luck. Oh, God, we don't have well, a base. Oh, shit. Uh, okay, this is going to be tough. Let's do this. Hold the line. Love is in all ways on time. Red team, you have to hold the banished back until the professor's done her work. Don't worry, sir, we've got her. Where are the ODST troops? And it oh, looks like there. we've got company right now. Oh, this time you've got control of all the Spartans. Yay! This control room has a defensive shield, but it won't last long. You just keep the wolves at bay. Okay, where can we build turrets? Oh god, I think this might be another base defense the one. Fire's weapons are at your disposal, Spartan. Get the Ooh. ship in the fight. But this time we don't have a base. Wait a minute. Sweet, dude. Oh shit, that is so cool. Dude, look at the amount of what? supplies we've got. We haven't got any. Exactly. Everything's free. It's free! Okay, what do we got? Marines! Uh, ready to uh, Marines. Take Garrison! There's a massive influx of banished heading to your position, team. Lock and load. No one crosses that line. Constructed. Garrisoning. I'm going to send one Spartan to each of the garrison points. Enemy is attacking with Turret constructed. Ah, like your structure. Structure. Turret constructed. Right, uh, Turret constructed. if you want, because you've got control of the Spartans, I'm going to take control of the two air units, and you move them accordingly. Right. I've garrisoned all my units. Okay. Push it. I'm receiving fire all units. Unless of course you want to trade. Uh, I'm panicking, man, I'm panicking. Parades under fire from enemy ground troops. All units. Right. I've got two, so uh Ah, those air units you've got are nightingales. I didn't notice that. If you need more units, ODST drop is free to use. Looks like. Nice. Uh, dude. Yep. We don't have any um, limit on how many troops we can use either. Nice. I'm putting down some mines right at that entrance, and. Yep, as soon as I'm ready to, I'll set up another mine. Red team, reinforcements are ready for you at the LZ. <laughs> Damn, cool. Over. You know I'm what, just going to check something out. This might not be so bad. Dude, on the opposite side of the map, 
to where I'm heading. There's a little triangle thing. Check it out, would you? Little triangle? Ooh, I managed to call that in just in time. Upgraded. Turret upgraded. Before I lost fog of war. Warlord out of action. Sweet. So that's what that is. I say we destroy them. Oh, hello. I have a few more troops. All units. Yeah, troops got called in. Leader power ready. We got hostiles, team. Turret upgraded. Turret upgraded. Oh, this is actually pretty epic. <laughs> Turret upgraded. Oh, we got a lot coming in there. Uh... Close air support. Let's see what this one is. I've not seen this yet. Call in the pelicans. Oh, I'm just cool. picturing loads of the, uh, look birds at that. coming in. Oh my god, that's cool. That's the ability close air support. Can you support. control them? No, they stay for a limited amount of time shooting at anything that enters their range. I'm a little bit of a disappointment, but. Okay, I'm no. moving my nightingales over to this side to heal, but... Uh, lotus but no, mines. I'm planting cool, lotus mines in this one. Just in case enemies manage to get past, you know, we might as well set up better defences. Yeah. I've upgraded... Oh, yeah, by the way, I've upgraded to anti-infantry on the turrets. Dude, that at least deserved the chuckle. Uh... Dude, we are In totally minute, fucking these guys up. Troops down to that corner, if you want to, if you want to give me a hand. Yeah, I've Might actually just objective. dropped a bunch. Where, where have you dropped them? Oh uh, no, I dropped them in the middle. All oh, right. I just need them to recharge at the moment. But yeah, we could probably call in some extra stuff down there as well. More units just got dropped in for us. Nice. Leader power ready. My archer missiles are ready. ODST is almost Contact. full up. We've taken out an enemy structure. Leader power ready. I'm going over to the left, the right hand side over here now. Oh, he ran into a lotus mine. Poor him. Hostile ground troops are trying their luck. Leader power ready. Nice. Ready? I don't see any ground troops. All units. Enemy vehicles on me. Leave the nightingales alone. Oh my god, I have two tanks. Oh my god, destroy that fucker. Thank you. I'm being hit by enemy vehicles, over. I have another nightingale. Dude, Ooh, if you have, have a nightingale, send one to, um, if you have one, to meet up with my one. I do yeah. have one. Where is it? Ah, oh, there they are. Over here. No, other way. Oh. Other side, because those two, there are already two here. Over here on the map. Right, in that case. It's complicated. So many protocols. I probably have to If we get two nightingales eventually at each of these entrances, then they'll be unkillable. I mean. To be honest, we could probably just dump all the rest of our troops down there. If you that target. Troops in the top right. 
that target down there. If we can get somebody there, and then I can activate the pelican. Dude, close air support. Look what just turned up. Yeah, I see them. No, 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 no. We've got two grizzlies. Mine. <laughs> I have two more nightingales. Oh shit! Grizzly tanks. Those were my one of my favourites in the original game. All units. Oh, we got a couple of other fuckers over here. Oh, did you give me the control of that um, nightingale? Yeah. Okay. What is that? Are oh, you to control of one of their t their things? Yeah. Nice. Uh, what happened to my? Did my uh, nightingales die? I don't know. Oh. Yeah, I think no. I've still got four. Oh no! Yeah, my nightingale died. Oh well. No problem. I almost have close air support back. Nice. Once I, I have that, it, yeah. it is pretty cool. Drop it right on top of that unit. That's up there, if you know what I mean. There's no need. The grizzly just appeared. Reinforcements ready for your command, red team. All units, leader power ready. All units. All units. Taking a little trip up here. Nice. I am going to uh, now. I'm going to use my close air support. I hey, wouldn't go into that area. For, oh, I tried to warn them. I tried to warn them. That's it. Two brute warlords down. Oh, dude, 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 dude. Don't leave that area. Why? There's something there on the minimap. On the map there. Oh, cool. It's a phoenix log. And mine. Okay, time to get back. Building killers. Yeah, I see them. Okay, let's get back in there and... More building killers. ODST, you can get a garrison in there. I'm under fire if you can garrison that building there... I've just lost mine. My team and I are ready, sir. All units. Moving to location. We're under attack from enemy vehicles, over! Get it prepped, ASAP! I love the, um... turret drop ability. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Go easy next time, these things aren't free. Never attack a grizzly. I love how easy this seems to be going. I mean, seriously, we could literally just put all of our troops in the middle and they would that. Because I thought, why not? But you know what? I'm going to pull all my attempts to... Wow, even more... Anti-air! I just viewed my mic for a quick second there by mistake. Anti-air <laughs> troops. Oh, and I'm going to transform that. Yeah. You have another grizzly and you've got a um, Kodiak. Uh, you might as well dump him into... Oh, fuck! Dude, you can take that over. Condor. The fuck is that? It's mine. It's laser. Um. Playback time. Make it hurt, guys. Dude, can you? Have you got a uh, yeah, Spartan still? I do. Don't take over that scarab. Where is he? Where is he? 
I know, I'm just trying to fucking find him. Hey, you. If I kill him, I apologize. I can't take him over. I can't take him over. Pull your people back, hurry man. Up. Pull them back. I'm putting them all back to the center. Because I can't be out. Alice is walking past. Please. Please let me take control of this. Can you? I don't know. It would appear not. Okay, just hit it with everything you got then. Nah, no, use the when ground you say pound, but that's everything. it. Everything. Everything. ODST drop right on top of you. How we doing? Just finishing up. Hang on. Okay, I've got it. The ring's disarmed, and the communications relay is in place. Yay! Well, that's a little more complicated. I'm going to have to go down into the ring to set it up. I need more time. Well, we can give you all the time you need. Okay, let's get everyone back to the center. Dude, the amount of troops we have is insane. And more ODST. Uh, yeah, I was just about to do that. <laughs> Holy shit! Dude, have you just seen the armor we've got? Yeah. No, I was actually worried when we didn't have a base, but you know what? Fuck the base. I just know. give us this setup every time we go into a mission. I'm good. This is overpowered. All units. I'm especially this condor thing. I mean, here, dude. Check it out, it's yours now. Cool. And this one can shoot air units, and it's got oh lasers! Cool! How cool is that thing? Shit, the Kodiaks, of course. I Before that, I was trying to set that up. I forgot about those. Uh, where are the Kodiak? Target eliminated. They can't shoot down air units. Great. Right. Marines under fire from enemy air units. Do you read? I have so many different ones. Kodiak. I have the Kodiak. I want you to come. Yeah, come here and set up right there. That's perfect. All units. Does this count as anti-air assistance? Just the turret drop. Enemy is looking for the over. Okay, I've set up another Kodiak as well, so they'll give extra bombardment of support. This is so cool. Have you tried using the Condor's super ability yet? Oh, Not yet. For fuck's sake, more! Give it back. I want it back. Give me back my condor. I will. In a minute. Do it now. Dude, the banish are just trying and failing now. It's miserable for them. Like little kid who can't get like, was that? Whoa. I don't know what your super is, but you use it on that. Oh, it's probably this big fucking rail gun they got underneath. Can I put back now? Uh, dude, uh, what's with the big target on the map? 
What big target? There was a very large red circle on the map a minute ago. I don't know. All units. All units. All units. You know, I reckon we must have made this thing thanks to Isabel. This is probably a staple in the Halo Wars now. God, I hope so. Sir, we won't be able to hold them off indefinitely. Yes, we will. Shut up, Jerome. Time's running out. Communications array is ready, Captain. You said it yourself. We can't leave until the banished are gone. I found something down here that'll help. Is by any chance just sending all of our troops back up to the spirit of fire and using the uh, halo? Leader power ready. Oh no! I don't want that to happen. Forge sacrificed himself in Halo Wars One. I don't want her to sacrifice herself. By the way, I've just upgraded the turret to anti-vehicle. Seems to be facing a lot more vehicles than anything else at the moment. Uh, do you know who I've realized that we haven't faced yet? Atriox. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Anytime he wants to come down, let him do so. Although I am wondering what the fuck he's going to come attack in. If it were me, I'd want to go for the Spirit of Fire. Get rid of the main base of operations. No, not just that. I mean, in Halo Wars 1, the ultimate vehicle for the Marines was the Vulture, and the ultimate vehicle for the Covenant was the Scarab. But now, the ultimate vehicle for the Marines isn't just the Vulture, it's that big fucking thing that you've got. Yeah. So I can't help but wonder what if the Covenant have something else, like a Super Scarab? Well, didn't they try and build one of those in one of the Halo games? Yeah, actually, I'm pretty sure they did. There was like a oh. scarab that was like five scarabs in one. You think you can stand against me? I will defy the All troops all troops in the middle, dude. Just bring them all to the middle. Here's your notice, Atriox. The Ark is our home now, and it's under our protection. Is that oh we've held out for like half an hour already. Hold out for two minutes. <laughs> bring it on. There he is. Oh shit. Something's coming. What is it? Here. Wait, two of them? I'm putting my... Ah, shit, me. I'm putting my troops there, top right. Make up your mind. <laughs> okay, I'll go that to that one. Oh, they've got another Scarab. I think they've probably got three. All units. Yep, they've got another one. Condor! Please use your Y ability. Dealt with. Oh shit! I think I might have two on me. Well, I've just called down close air support on this one. So this one can go fuck itself. <laughs> Dude, guess what I've just done? What's that? Look at that scarab. Oh shit! Oh, dude, look how cool that is! <laughs> Yeah, we fucked that one up. Oh god, that was awesome. Okay, Look at that, what they're all just flying here? in a circle around each other. That is awesome. <laughs> that was pretty badass. We got a whole oh, shit. Up for 30 seconds. Do you think we've managed it? We'll be fine. Dude, he's not even going to be able to take out his shield before. Before we can finish this. I don't think it's done a single point yet, of damage to the shields. Nope. But our troops are clear, Professor. Whatever you're gonna do, do it now. Here we go. Oh boy. Let's see what she's Bring gonna do. Bring all our troops together, buddy. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. 
Come on, what are you gonna do? No fucking way! She just tossed them all into outer space right off the halo. <laughs> Fire is five minutes. Bring up the map. We have a lot of work to do until she gets back. I kept it. That was awesome. With your actions. Yeah. I'm proud of all of you. Dude. That was pretty cool. Look at the fucking part time. Oh fuck you! Wait, how is that even fair? We had a time limit. Literally. <laughs> that is not fair. Dicks. But that was pretty damn awesome. She sent yeah. them to space, and if we don't have another um, chapter after this one. Then that looks like it's another hint at a pre uh, sequel. Mm -hmm. We should wait until after the credits as well. There's usually a extra True. cutscene after the credits for Halo games. All right then. Um, that was a that was a pretty good game. I think I'm um, yeah. reasonably pleased with it. I would have liked it to be longer, if I'm honest. Yeah, but I mean only twelve episodes. I think it was but... quite good. Yeah. What did you think? Okay, uh, let's press continue and head straight into the credits. I believe that should happen. Yep, there we go. We're in the credits. So yeah, no, what did you think of the game as a whole? Pretty cool, actually. Some of the new units are really, really fun, especially that last one that they gave us. And that last mission was pretty fun as well. It's a shame that it took that long to, to get to that good unit. I know, I would right? like to have it control, control of it for at least maybe one or two rounds. Mm. But, but no, I think the, um, the game we didn't was get... good. We didn't get control of that forerunner unit at all. We were kind of in the no, middle that, of everything. We didn't really pay attention to that, but still. But no, I think the gameplay itself was pretty damn good. And mm -hmm. the cutscenes were absolutely gorgeous. Mm -hmm. 
they definitely deserve a round of applause for the cutscenes at the very least. That was yeah. some of the best CGI work I think I've seen in a while. Yeah. Okay, uh, we'll cut forward from here to the final cutscene if there is one at the end of the credits. So we'll see you there. See you guys. Nah, you can talk during this. But not when they're talking. The Halo has arrived! What's happening? Why do we drop out of slip space? Oh shit. Um that's a guardian. Remember the great big machines of mass destruction I just told you about that Cortana was waking up? That's one of them and I just realized something else. Oh shit, it all connects. At the end you of, share with the rest of the class? Um, at the end of Halo Five, the cutscene at the end of the credits was Cortana on board a Guardian, looking out of the viewing port and seeing a Halo. I think we just saw the exact same scene from a different viewpoint. This is the Halo that Cortana has just taken control of at the end of Halo Five. <laughs> that is so cool. <clears throat> It all links together. Oh well, shit. That's not a hell of a revelation. Yeah. Now I want to go back and play Halo 5 again. <laughs> shit. <laughs> okay. That was a that's hell of an a ending. Hell of an so. ending to uh, yeah. Halo Wars. And that's the end of our Halo Wars 2 playthrough. Thank you for joining us. I'm Vin Credible from the VCCS. And I'm Cautious Snake from the VCCS. See you guys. Bye-bye.